Hello? Testing? All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back with some Fallout 4, uh, or, and I have Kiri with me temporarily as a companion. Went to fetch her, and I just, I only want her for this quest here. Then we're going to leave her at Vault 81 again. No, wait, not this one. Uh, the Road to Freedom. Let's see, I have my equipment, right? I have Stealth Boys. There's a musket. Do I want my shotgun? That is a good question. Hmm. Nah, I think I'll do good without it. I think I'll be better off without it for now. <clears throat> and we're gonna start from Park Street Station and we're gonna go from there. Hope you all having a good day. I'm having a good day. Woke up a little bit. But then that fine ish. <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Look at that gun, broadsider. Hmm. Only one way to get that though, and that's a quest I've never done before. <coughs> well, just because I don't know. I don't know why I've not done that quest. And look at that. I'm almost at level thirty. Just need a bit more XP right there, and then I'm I'm there. So we're shot radio. Anyway, we go over here, I think. Maybe it's over here. Yeah, it's over here. What was that? Oh. Seven. And A. Some sort of code? Could be, could be. Ooh, some new color. Can, yes? No, no, no. Well, if you talk about the bottle, probably, but I could break it down from some glass. I think I just saw Swan. <clears throat> Let's see, here we go. Four. Mm, L. That's definitely a code. Let's see. Do I go. I go back this way, I think. Following the freedom trail, following the freedom trail. <coughs> Are there ghouls here? First thing coming. Can we explore? Uh, we're a little bit busy, Kerry. Oh, no. Where? They shouldn't take long. Eh, you know what, they can sell it themselves. Let's see, which way do we go now? Okay, I'm just gonna take a wild guess. Yes, I was right. Alright, keep going. Now a six and an O. Let's keep going, Kerry. We're all hot on the trail. Hi there. Stay down. Three I. Uh oh. Shit. Yeah, 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 that's right, you're hearing shit. You're hearing shit. Still. There is something nearby. Identity unknown. Uh, identity found. It's a super mutant. Five R. I mean. <laughs> I only moved a little bit, dude. Did you, the other one that lost me. 
Yeah, good luck with that. I'm like the wind. Annoy. <coughs> Indeed. Hey, you did to find my jaw uh jumpsuit again. I should mm. Come back down here and fight. <coughs> that one had a missile launcher. Good thing I broke him. I took him down. Now I've lost the trail. Also lost the Superman. Oh, here he is. Nope. That's not it. Where is the Superman uh, Suicider? Here he is. Thank you. Alright, let's see. Continue on. Come on, Carrie. We're hot on the trail. I can feel it. <clears throat> the bones. Actually, you know what? Might as well top off. Uh oh, Kerry, you idiot! Kerry, you idiot! Kerry, you idiot! Get away from the truck! Is it gonna blow? There we go, it's gonna blow now. Kerry, you gotta be careful around the vehicles, they are highly explosive. I'll show you. Wait for it. Wait for it. Yep, yeah, there it is. <coughs> See, I told you, you gotta be careful around those vehicles. I already discovered North Church. 1R. Hmm. The trail ends right at the church. You can read, pause and read this if you want. This is just, you know, the history of behind the church. Anyway, Kerry, you ready? The tr the the pfft, the trail it ends here, so it must be here. Search for the railroad. It's, the school is here, so I might as well just pick out a melee weapon. Indeed, now look at it. It's a ruined wreck. <laughs> yeah, you gotta get used to this, Carrie. This is the w way of things. I think they're below us. Oh, we'll just follow this nicely painted painted uh, lantern. <coughs> And the over here. <laughs> How did they not carry you still with me? This is spooky. Hello there. And goodbye. I feel uneasy. Hey! I don't know where you came from, but I don't like it. Alright. That's my, my decoding skills come in handy. Uh. Hmm. 
It spins. Oh, so it starts with R. Dude, the password was railroad. Get it, Curry? <coughs> Hello? Anybody? Hello? Stop right there. You went through a lot of effort to arrange this meeting. But before we go any further, answer my questions. Who the hell are you? Uh, why don't you tell me who you are first? Why don't you tell me who you are first? You wanted... Come on. It's an easy speech check. It's an easy speech check. Don't do me like this. If I have to put on my general's outfit, I will. Don't make me take it out. Why don't you tell me who you are first? You wanted to... I will keep reloading. You know who I. You know how I am. I will keep reloading till I pass that speech check. The only one I have to worry about is Deacon, who I will put my general's minute outfit on. Why don't you tell me who you are first? In a world full of suspicion, treachery, and hunters, we're the synths' only friends. We're the railroad. So answer my question. I followed the freedom trail looking for the railroad. I'm not your enemy. If that's true. You have nothing to fear. Who told you how to contact us? I just heard a rumor about you guys, in Good Neighbor. I see. I'm Desdemona, and I'm the leader of the railroad. And you are? Deacon, where have you been? You're having a party. What gives with my invitation? I need intel. Who is this? Wow. Newsflash, boss. This guy is kind of a big deal out there. Glad someone noticed. You know, you're practically famous. The Brotherhood of Steel let you into their ranks. That's a hell of a thing there. And, as if that wasn't enough, you're the leader of the Minutemen. I hear you cleared out the castle. Everyone's talking about that. So you're vouching for him? Yes, trust me. He's someone we want on our side. That changes things. So, stranger, why did you want to meet with us anyway? Uh... My son, Sean. I think. My son, Sean, was kidnapped. I'm looking for help to find him. Someone stole your boy? That's terrible. Do you know who did it? For your sake, I hope the Institute isn't involved. Kellogg kidnapped him. Kellogg kidnapped him. Well, you got your revenge. But that doesn't bring your son back. I'll have Deacon look into this. If anyone can find a lead on your boy, he can. If we're going to be dealing with you, I need to make sure we're on the same page. You know what a synth is, right? Uh, know about them? Yeah, I know all about them. Good. The Institute treats synths as property, as tools. That sounds like slavery, or slavery is wrong. That sounds like slavery. Exactly. So we seek to free the synths from their bondage. Give them a chance at a real life. I have a question. The only question that matters would you risk your life for your fellow man, even if that man is a synth? Oh, I love this part. I love this part. Wait for it. And once I pledged my life to protect my countrymen. I don't see this as any different. Well said. We'll do what we can to look into your missing boy. What the Institute has done to your family and others is what drives us. Normally, you're exactly the type of person we try and recruit. But right now, we don't have the time to train up a new agent. There are, however, other valuable ways you can contribute. And in turn, we can help you. See Deacon for details. You're free to go. Hey. What do you want? I have made some medicine for you. Oh, wait, you, like? you never... 
You never do that. Or should first should do that. That's all for now. As you say. Level up. And now I'm gonna put on my general's minute men outfit. Because I need to reach level 30 and start tradecraft. Talk to Deacon. Hope you didn't mind the reception. When you tango with the Institute, you gotta be careful when someone new gets on the dance floor. Uh, forgive. Not commit or angry. Forgive. Your leader was just being cautious. It must put all of you in a very delicate situation. Exactly. Kind of killed our chance at a friendly first impression, though. But it's all good now. I vouched for you. Nobody got shot. Still, I would consider it a close personal favor if you didn't sell us out to the Institute. Thanks. Uh, this is where I need, yeah, vouch for me. So tell me, why did you vouch for me? In our little outfit, it's my job to know things. And with everything you've done, it's clear you're capable. A dangerous enemy. And I'm betting a valuable ally. But why the trust? You can't be taking it all on faith. I don't know if we can trust you, but I hope we can. We just survived a hell of a crisis, so we may just be a teeny weeny bit desperate for new members. If everything was sunshine and bottle caps, we'd probably play a longer getting to know you game. But we don't have that luxury. Really? Is that all? I've heard a lot. Nope. I'm passing that speech check. I am going to pass that speech check whether you like it or not, Deacon. I mean, how many times I have to reload and resave? Because <clears throat> it's all information I want. Really? Is that all? I've heard a lot. Plus, it actually kind of tells you a little bit more about the railroads back X a little bit. If you're not going to look up on the wiki, you might as well hear from here. Really? Is that all? I've heard a lot. Hence why it's kind of a tough speech check to do. <clears throat> really? Is that all? I've heard a lot. And I will keep reloading and trying to get that information. Plus, it's a speech check I want to pass for that XP. I'm, I really want the XP too. Really? Is that all? I've heard a lot. This is why I put my Min Min outfit on. I mean, I passed the other two speech checks, no problem. Why is the third one giving me trouble? Just because it's a hard speech check? <clears throat> Come on, Deacon. Really? Spill the beans. Is that all? I've heard a lot. Spill the beans, Deacon. Spill the beans or I'm out of here. I mean, it's not too much to ask, right? <clears throat> he spilled the beans. We go do whatever it is you want. Really? Is that all? You just don't give up. There you go. All right. I have a short list of people I think would be a good fit for our family. You piqued my interest, so maybe I asked around. Did my homework. If you hadn't found us, there's a chance I would have found you instead. Thanks for saving me the trip. So Des wants me to make you a tourist. That's what we call someone who helps out with the odd job here and there. What a waste. I'm just gonna come out and say this. The railroad needs you. You got my attention. I got a job. Too big for me, just perfect for the two of us. You help me out, we turn a few heads, and then Des invites you into the fold. Then, if you get into a bind and need some help, your buddies in the railroad got your back. I'll take the job. Sign me up then. Perfecto. Let's meet up at the old freeway outside of Lexington. I'll fill you in once you get there. Alright, just... Des, are you really going to keep e smoking like that? It's going to kill you one of these days, Des. Whatever. Let's go. Now we have to track all the way back through the tunnels. And Kerry, I'm dropping you off for a little bit. <clears throat> back at Vault 81. Uh, come on. Kerry.
because I want Deacon as the companion next. Then we do some railroad quests. We get in good with them. Actually, I'm going to complete quite a few rail railroad quests. Then I'm going to... Well, we'll see what happens. Because <clears throat> I already have a list. A list of things I want to do to in these next few episodes. Yeah, weapons typically do more damage for taking more weight in your inventory. So it owes you down when they're equipped. Yeah, indeed they owe. Can't believe I'm level 30 already. Oh, I forgot to choose a perk. I want the pickpocketer. <clears throat> There's the reasons I'll explain later. Alright, let's... Let's go back to Vault 81. Then drop off Kerry, then go and meet Deacon. <coughs> what time is it? It's only 21 minutes. It's good. Didn't take long for me to find the railroad goodie. Hey. May I be of assistance? Yes? It's about time for you to go. I look forward to resuming our journeys. I do as well, Carrie. I do as well. Even though you're a hard companion to get likes out of, you're a favorite of mine. Let's see. I think I'll travel to Drumlin Diner <coughs> and go from there. Vault suit and other, and a few other pieces of clothing like long johns, radar leathers, are thin enough to be worn underneath additional pieces of armor. Yep. And you look good while using it as well. Nice people comment on it like, are you a vault brother or something? What the? You're oh, my... Alright, let's keep going. <coughs> Hello, is anybody in this house? Seller. Sorry, didn't mean to disturb you. Over the river and through the woods. Deacon, where are you? Deacon, Deacon. Now that I think about, I want my Pikmin laid out. This one. There you are. Hey. Deacon, is that you? Like the disguise? It's Wastelander Camo. This is my pile of garbage, asshole. Back off. Good, right? <laughs> You're lucky I didn't do one of my face swaps, too. They almost fooled me, yeah. I almost didn't recognize you. That's the point. So, about the job. The railroad's only recently been using the old North Church. Our old base was underneath the Slocum's Joe. We had a pretty sweet setup until the Institute found us. Uh, sounds really bad. That sounds really, really bad. It was a disaster with a capital D. The survivors didn't have time to grab anything. So we're getting something important we had to leave behind. Uh, let's go find it then. Let's find it then. We gotta do one thing first. We got a tourist nearby. He or she has information on the base. So let's pump him for information before we dive in. For now, I'll take point. So I'm looking for rail signs, symbols we use to send messages to each other. If you like that, we got signs and counter signs, dead drops, even a secret handshake. All right, maybe the handshake never caught on. 
Anyway, the tourist should have a trail left for us. Here we go. Rail sign. The arrow in the center indicates a direction. So our tourist is up ahead. Let's keep going. So Deacon, loving the outfit by the way. Ah, uh, you sure this place is safe? Let's play I Spy. Let's see, I Spy something that is dead. Got another rail sign, right there. Okay, maybe not. I spy something that's coming out. If you guess school, you'll be right. And another. We're probably close. You're not playing the game, are you? Alright, fine. I'm right behind you, don't worry. See the plus in the center? That means there's an ally nearby, our tourist. You take point on the conversation. Look, no matter what he says, you just say, mine is in the shop. Trust me. Hey. Alright. Ooh, that looks a little bit... Eh, never mind. Oh, thank God. Do you have a Geiger counter? Do you have a goddamn Geiger counter? Mine is in the shop. Who the hell is he? HQ said they were sending one agent, not two. Sorry, I'm new. He's just showing me the ropes. All right. The wall is my witness. I thought I was dead. It's about goddamn time you headquarters bastards got here. Uh, you're safe now. It's all right. We're here now. You're safe. You think I'm goddamn safe? That little slocum Joseph of yours is crawling with goddamn chrome dome and sons of bitches. The front's fortified to hell and back. They place mines all over the goddamn place. What do you mean by chrome dome synths? You know, them early model synths. Looks like metal wrapped over mechanical innards. You see them here and there doing who knows what for the Institute. They have a minefield? Yeah, the mother of all minefields. I couldn't draw you a map if I tried. I appreciate all you've done. I hope it helps. I really do. As soon as it's safe, I'm getting the hell out of here. So if you need anything else, better ask soon. Well, isn't Ricky just a ray of sunshine? You think he's telling the truth? He doesn't strike me as the dishonest type. Yeah, that's my read too. First rule in this business is never go against your gut. So if we take him at his word, the front door has mines, synths, and probably other fun and exciting prizes. So, we're going in through the escape tunnel. Uh, take the tunnel then. The tunnel has got to be easier than a frontal assault. Easier, but no cakewalk. You lead us there, pal. I got you covered. But I don't know where the escape tunnel is. Well, except for my pip. I'm guessing the pip boy gives you a hut or whatever. Alright, let's go. Oh, Deacon. Deacon. All right, let's see. Now do you want to play Ice Spy Deacon while we're ahead there? I mean, Ice Spy, I mean, it's kind of ruined anyway. I Spy with my dead and I something that is brown. If you guess the car, you'd be right. I Spy with my dead You know, like dead eye from Red Dead Redemption. I mean, like in the Western movies. 
In my eye, something that is brown. If you guess the trees, yeah. You're good at this game, Deacon. <clears throat> what was that? good tonight Deacon if you don't mind mongrel meat hey there's power armor in there and it's T40 no it could be X it could be uh, T60 for all I know <coughs> or 45 it could be 45 I'll come back and get it later found it Deacon Deacon, buddy. Deacon? Okay, there you go. Alright, I think I want to switch weapons now. Into the zoo we go. <clears throat> We're in. The back entrance is safer, but be ready for Gen 1s and 2s. So it's time you learn why we're here. We're retrieving a prototype developed by our good Dr. Carrington. But what can you tell me about the Gen 1s and 2s? The synths didn't start off as nigh-perfect copies of human beings. The Institute had to work up to that level of hubris. Gen 1s and 2s were stepping stones along the way. The railroad's not fully united on how we feel about them. What's there to be divided about? Everyone wants to liberate the Gen 3s, the human-looking synths. Some of the synths in the railroad, like Glory, think we should help earlier models, too. But Gen 1s are basically the same as, well, a Protectron. So the line gets muddy. Do we defend AI rights? Terminals? Hell, turrets? Anytime it gets brought up, pow, fireworks. All the old arguments flare up. The upshot is Glory and some others won't run missions like this. Let's find a prototype then. Together with you? I like our odds. First step is to override the security lockdown. And how do we do that, Deacon? You go the you go first. Or not. There's a terminal here. It's a master lock. I can't do this. Well, the terminal's on at least. I'm gonna feed it some passwords. No. 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 Aha! Missed one, you cocky bastards. The prototype's deeper inside. Well, that's good, right? Uh. Found the dead body. Someone left a rail sign here. Uh, this one means danger. Yeah, we know. We got company, Deacon. Stop moving around. Got him. A rat roach. Dead. Why didn't you attack the synth? Hostile sensor reading. Movement detected. detected. Curious. Uh, it's nothing. Hmm. Overactive sensors. Nothing more. Wait, see the box in the center of that rail sign? That means there's a cache nearby. Looks like Maven managed to hide something before. Well, you know. Look around. Uh, here? Found it. We might have company ahead. Is someone present? No. It would appear your attempt at stealth has failed. Systems offline. I am shutting down. 
Cooper managed to turn on the defenses. Barely slowed the coursers down, but hey, probably saved some lives. I don't think you've ever seen a courser, but they're top of the line in Institute. Let's fuck up your day tech. There shouldn't be any coursers in here, but if there are, just run. Duly noted. Duly noted. Alright, let's keep going. <clears throat> I think we're good for now. I was just losing the turret, there's nothing. Not another dead box. Active terminal. We didn't have time to trip the defenses up ahead. Power them up, and we can give our friends a little surprise. Hello? Activate. Oh, and your friends missed some math is too be wobbling. Let him go. Oh, now he stopped. The sensitivity of my sensors clearly needs adjustment. There you are. <laughs> no, you don't. Oh, you took my kill. Uh, sure, let's go with that. Alright, into the tube we go. <coughs> Hello? Let's see, uh... Gotta figure the password out, Deacon. That's it. Huh, lucky guess. Movement detected. No, th Everybody freeze! I, Hello. I missed so many shots. <laughs> I missed so many shots, I'm disappointed in myself. You can get in the way. I buy Gen 1s. Prepare to be shocked. Not every Slocum's Joe has a massive tunnel complex underneath it. We're entering a secret defense intelligence agency research lab, a place that never officially existed. It's called the Switchboard. The prototype is locked up in the heart of the facility. Uh, I'm somewhere. How about you tell me where you went? Pistol, garbage. Fusion core, not garbage. Teddy bear, not garbage. I can't pick up that deflated ball.
Here we go. Nice. Yeah, whistling in the dark. Do something. I don't mean block by shot. Following institute protocol, eliminating hostile. Shh, Deacon, I think they're surrounding us. Let's go with that. What was that? Whatever it is, it gave me quite a spook. They were wise, Whatever it is, just gave me quite the spook. Hostile sent to a stealthy attack it was unsuccessful. And not I'm sorry, what I was doing? Ooh, armor. Where's that play button? Carrington, Stanley, Salas Grote, Supreme Lex. Open says me. <laughs> So Tommy Whispers didn't make it out. He died protecting our secrets. Let me see. There. Tommy would want you to have his hand cannon. Don't let its size fool you. I appreciate it. May it serve you as well, heck, better than it did Tommy. The Liverer. Grab Carrington's prototype. You turn that over to Desdemona, and she'll have to let you into our merry band. Alright, let me just equip this deliverer. Stealth boy, stealth boy. Nice. Here's this prototype. There's an elevator at the end of the hall. It should be a hell of a lot easier fighting the chrome domes on this side of the minefield. I'm just gonna grab that. Grab this stuff, cause heck, why not? Oh yeah, I'm loving this pistol. Let's check over here for any loot. Lower limb actuator damaged. Let's see, let's see, uh... Come on. When I take my time with this... There we go.
Take that nuke cone though. The chest board. Come <coughs> on, right, Deacon, we're almost out here. Hello? Is someone present? Power elevator. I'm very proud to have the complete. End of the line. Just power up the elevator. I just did. Come on, Deacon. In we go. And I'll just press the button. <coughs> Going up. Hell of a mission, ain't it, Deacon? Hell of a mission. The institute doesn't know a thing. Floor? Yeah, there we go. To come wealth and beyond. I hear bad things upstairs. Movement detected. Curious. All clear. Take that pre-roll money though. What was that? That's probably the guy with the fat man. We got what we came for. Let's split up and meet back at the catacombs. We made a good team. The best. See you soon. I wouldn't walk out there, uh, Deacon. There's still the minefield. I got one of them. I got two of them. Almost cost me a laugh. My hip. <laughs> Everything else almost blew up. Oh, I almost died. I really should put more points in endurance. <laughs> kind of reminds you of the time when I tried to reach the castle. I ran into a minefield, blew myself up, and uh, had to reload a previous save. <coughs> <coughs> Thank God the time machine works. I reissue your Tesla magazine. You collect that to rank the Tesla perk, which grants a slight increase to the critical hit damage with energy weapons. <clears throat> right, let's go and deliver the prototype. And what time is it? It is fifty minutes. 
So make a good progress, good progress. Keep going. Where am I? All right, let me just save the. And the new guy patched me up, put me on his shoulder, and blasted his way through the rest of the complex. Since everywhere. Carrying you the whole time? Amazing, right? That's one word for it. Deacon told me you single-handedly secured Carrington's prototype, disabled a minefield, and wiped out a hundred Gen 1s. So is any of that true? Uh, tell the truth. Mostly true, but there weren't a hundred of them. And Deacon was with me the whole way. Embellishing the truth again, are we? She would have fallen for it, you know? Don't flatter yourself. Still, I was expecting Deacon to grab a full team, including Glory, to secure that prototype. But instead, just the two of you cleared out the entire switchboard. You'd be insane not to sign him up, Des. You've certainly made an impression on Deacon. He's never spoken about, or lied about, anyone so highly before. Welcome to the railroad, Agent. Uh, join the railroad. Glad to be aboard. It seems we're very lucky to have you. So you're in. Now we need to know what to call you. Secrecy keeps us alive. Code names are a part of that. So what's yours? Uh, Fixer, Professor, more options. No, code name. I don't want a code name. Code names aren't <coughs> optional. All agents need to keep their identity secret to protect themselves and those close to them. Uh, Professor, uh, there, there's a better choice. Yeah, let's go with that because she has a good one. I really don't want to choose. Suit yourself. We'll call you Wanderer. Seems fitting. Your first official order is to deliver Dr. Carrington his prototype and see if he can use another pair of hands. But first, it's time to meet the rest of the gang. The location of our HQ is you one of our most tightly guarded to go far sequence, with us. So be careful tell. coming in or out. You never can tell when you're being watched. You have a secret attached to your, uh... Wrist that does Mona. You do realize that, right? <laughs> Started Boston after dark. <clears throat> Bring Carrington his prototype. Uh, about that does Bonish. I'm gonna keep bringing this up, but you do realize that the safety hazard. It may lack the amenities of the switchboard, but it's safe, and we've taken precautions not to be surprised again. Things are chaotic right now. So there's plenty for you to do. Is Deacon come with? Listen up, everyone. This is the Wanderer. He did the switchboard op with Deacon. He's a full agent, effective immediately. I'm counting on each of you to show him the ropes. Feel free to welcome him aboard. That is all. Excuse me. Welcome to the family. We're a colorful and arguably insane bunch. But you're stuck with us now. Speaking of which, if you don't mind a sidekick, let's keep a good thing going and travel together some more. Don't they need you here? My job's mainly intel. So, the more places I go, the better I'm doing it. And you are just one big beautiful distraction. Plenty of opportunities to learn secrets moving around in your shadow. Let's go then. I'm all ready to go. Alright ladies and gentlemen, I think that will do it for this episode. I'd like to thank you for tuning in. Do leave a like, subscribe, comment, share the video. And I shall see you next episode shortly. Till next time, bye bye!